I have a question for you. Have you even been on vacation with small children or traveling near others with small children? You may already know how hard it can be. This is the stack of luggage that accompanied me and my young son. That's my late husband, Sean, there. We overpacked for a three-day trip. Do you see what we have packed? That's for a three-day weekend getaway. And we swore we would never do it again after that trip. Uh, but you know what? Professional mob trotter Karen Apkan says it doesn't have to be difficult. She's got the tips and the tricks to make kid travel easier and more fun for everyone. That was a little, uh, those slings that you put your baby in right, yes. walk around with them. So uh, we've got Karen Apkan and her young son, who is five and a half. What's your name, young man? Aiden. Aiden. And you're five or six? Five and a half. Five and a half. <laughs> and you're a master traveler. So let's start with what to do first. Let's start with the backpack. Right. because that's really important. Um, I know I just got back with my seven-year-old and his backpack was filled with everything. Yes, so I'm sure. So how do we start? Where do we go? So basically what I do is I make sure that um, he packs things in his backpack that he can carry because I don't carry his backpack. Okay. So he's going to pack toys, you know, books, pens, pencils, everything that he needs is, is in his backpack. <laughs> and then he can pack a few toys from home. Uh, but the goal is to make sure that he has enough things to keep him entertained on the flight okay. without using a tablet. So you let him decide what's going to go in that backpack. Right, I do. Okay, and make sure that they can carry it themselves. Yes. Because you don't want to end up carrying it. Uh, no, for I them. don't. <laughs> um, I remember carrying this gigantic pillow for my kid, and it did help because when he was younger, he slept on it on my lap. But mm -hmm. what kind of pillow do you suggest bringing on the plane? Uh, so the first class travel pillow, it's perfect because you can blow it up. And because we, we had a 10 hour flight to, to Japan and he slept nine hours of the flight. It's really comfortable. You blow it up, you put it on there, and he just laid on there oh, wait a and minute. fell asleep. So, this is a pillow that yes. <laughs> blows up like a footstool? Wait a minute. Is that, is that what that is right there? That is exactly what it is. Oh. And so, when there's no air in it, it's really small and foldable, so it's easy to store and easy to put. Oh, this is it right that, here. That's exactly what it looks like. So, you can fold it up, put it in your backpack or purse. Oh, my gosh. And blow it up when you need to. This is a game changer. Yes. I wish I can still get this for my next trip. <laughs> okay, so uh, car seats. We all want to take the car seat with us. Is that a good idea? And how do we transport it? Yes, I highly recommend. We always travel with car seats. Um, so, what we do is we use the GoGo -Go Babies car seat transporter. Um, all you have to do is just snap the car seat onto it and then pull that around the airport and it basically turns a car seat into a stroller. Oh, okay, that's easy. That's really light. This is kind of like the old school like type of thing, right? Yes. Okay, that's pretty light. So this is good. This is good to know. And then we've got the uh, portable booster seat. So when you get to your destination, if you have an, a slightly older child, you don't have to carry around the booster seat with you. No, you don't. So this and is a and, portable and one? that was one of the best things that baby we found bum. out was baby bum. Baby <laughs> bum. Is that your baby bum? That's yeah. That's the, the that's one of the the foldable car seats. But this is another one. It's my fold. It's really small, foldable. It, again, it fits in a backpack and um, used for kids four years old and older. That's amazing. I've never. I haven't seen this one. I have the blow up one and that didn't really work for me. Okay, so the stroller, I saw you pushing this in. Oh, this yes. very nice. Your, is this your stroller, honey? Is that your is that, stroller, Aiden? Yes. What's different about this one? Um, so this one is basically like one of the smallest strollers. It folds and can fit in the overhead compartment oh and the plane, which That's is incredible. amazing. So this fits above uh, yes. in the overhead. So you don't have so to check many, it in. So many great tips, Karen. <laughs> thank you so much. Of thank course, you. you can catch more of Karen and Aiden's tips on her blog, Mom Trotter. You can get all the information on our website, boxla.com. Thank you, Aiden. You're, You're welcome. very, very handsome. <laughs> thank you. We'll be right back.